Thank you for watching Fuji Apple Learning with Heather McBain. This is the writing process. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at what our writing process looks like. So our writing process is when we start with previewing, drafting, revising, editing, and then finally publication. So let's see what all of these things really mean. So when we are pre-writing, that's when we are doing our planning and our brainstorming. This is one of the most important parts of your writing process. So when we are pre-writing, we're brainstorming, we're planning, we're going to be reflecting on our topic. We're going to be taking notes on our ideas. We'll decide on who will be the audience that our project is going to be for. We're going to choose a purpose for what we're writing. We're going to do some research on it. We will organize our ideas and then we'll create a writing plan. So these are all very, very important things for you to do and make sure that you are trying to keep all of your notes all together. After you're done with your pre-writing, you're going to start drafting your project. This is where you really start to put your thoughts on your paper, the actual writing in an essay form. So when you are drafting, you're putting your thoughts, feelings, and ideas on your paper. You're not going to worry about your spelling, your grammar, your capitalization, or your punctuation. That will all come later. So this is where you're going to complete your first draft of your ideas. After you've got that completed, you're going to take a look at what you've done and start revising it. So this is where you're reworking the organization and the details. You are completely altering your initial work and you're taking your essay apart and maybe re-piecing it back together, really taking a look at what you have written and making sure that everything flows together. So you want to make sure that the writing stays on topic, add relevant supporting details, delete any unnecessary words or details, look for logical order of events, use descriptive words, rewrite sentences so that they are easy for the reader to understand, and make sure that the writing is appropriate for the audience. And remember the audience is who's going to be reading your paper. Once you've got that completed, now we're gonna start editing. So when we edit, we review for proper format, we make sure that our spelling is correct, and we confirm for properly informed grammar. So this is where we're going to check all the sentences for correct capitalization and punctuation, make sure that subjects and verbs agree, confirm for consistent use of verb tense, check for your spelling, confirm that all writing satisfies MLA requirements or whatever requirement is that you are writing in, and confirm that essay meets all class requirements. So this is where you really want to read over your rubric, make sure that you didn't accidentally miss something. I also highly suggest that you take a moment during this po point and read it back to yourself or to someone else to make sure that it all flows smoothly. Now, once that's completed, now we get to talk about publication. And what publication is, is that's where you have completed your project and you are ready to submit it or print it or put it in its final form. So this is where you're going to take a moment for both reflection and assessment. So once you've reached this point, you want to reread your finished work out loud, evaluate the level of writing, seek outside assistance. So maybe ask for someone else to take a look at it with you, compare your essay with your previous work and create another revision if you have to. So this is our writing process. Remember you pre-write, you draft, revise, edit, and then you're ready to publish it or turn it in. Thank you for watching the writing process with Fuji Apple Learning.